A number of questions still surrounding the death of a student at Seguin High School last Friday. Bullying has not been ruled out in the suicide of a Seguin High School senior. That student, the son of a Seguin police officer, shot himself on campus Friday morning. Paul Venema visited the campus this morning as school officials and local police continue the investigation. Though students arrived for classes as normal here this morning, it was anything but a normal school day. There's a pall over Seguin High School this morning. District spokesman Sean Hoffman said that the staff has been busy over the weekend dealing with the Friday death of senior student Isaac Herrera. Our high school staff met yesterday afternoon to finalize plans for a counseling response team, which is on campus today. While counselors deal with grieving students, school officials are investigating Friday's incident. We will work with Seguin Police Department as they do and conduct their investigation um, into this. He said that among the things they're looking at is whether bullying was a factor. Because bullying is an issue in schools across the country, I think people conveniently will say that's a bullying case. But at this point, we haven't been able to verify that. The only comment from the Seguin Police Department is to say that they're personally grieving for the family. Professionally, the case is being carried simply as an apparent suicide. Since it is under investigation, they've not said where the student obtained the gun or whether there was a suicide note. In Seguin, Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.